<laughs> What's going on, family? It is Wednesday, and that makes Hunter's one year birthday. Oh my gosh, look at my Mr. Man over here. He's just playing with all his toys. We've been in his room all morning, playing with all his toys. He's been taking toys out of his toy box and just having a good old time. And I know I've been talking about this forever, but yes, it is finally his day. Yeah, buddy? Oh, okay. <laughs> We decided to have his birthday party for this upcoming Saturday, which is the 31st. And we didn't truly realize it was actually New Year's Eve when we when we set it up until like last week and everybody's like, um, you know it's New Year's Eve, but it's not gonna be a long party. It's probably gonna be from like 12 to three. I just, uh, you know, a couple hours so everybody can come say happy birthday to him and celebrate for a little while before they go out and, you know, have their New Year's festival festivities and things of that nature but you guys I have a big boy <laughs> I have a big boy and I cannot believe it he is truly my dream child okay he is my baby he is my heart and I'm just so blessed to have him look at him over there what are you doing buddy what are you doing <laughs> he seems to really love like balls, baseballs, basketball. His granddad, my my stepdad, had gotten him a golf set. So it's like a baby golf set. And he has been walking around the house with his little putter all morning. His grandparents said they're going to put him in golf, I guess at the age of three, three or four. Whatever the, young, the youngest age there is that you can put him in golf because Danny says he wants to have a little golfer around here. Someone to go golfing with <laughs> other than Josh, of course. But Mr. Man, Hunter. He is not thinking about me. One thing I can say about Hunter is he plays very well independently. Like when I'm in my office and I'm working on what I, well, whatnot, he'll come between my office and, and here playing with his toys, going back and forth. And he plays very well with other children that I've noticed because when we went to Josh's parents' house the other day, of course his cousins were over there and he was just very interested in what they were doing. And uh, his youngest cousin, Carmine, he's about a year older than Hunter. They played very well together and Hunter was really interested in everything he had to do and say and stuff like that. Which is weird because Hunter does not like people holding him, but he was up under Carmine like that was his best friend. He, he has only really interacted with Carmine maybe three or four uh, separate occasions, but he just really enjoyed being around other children, so I'm really happy about that. But anywho, Josh had to work today, so he'll be home pretty early, like around 2.30, 3 o'clock, and I think he's going to bring home a cupcake or a small cake for Hunter, which will be the first time that he's ever had, you know, sweets and things like that, because, you know, we don't let him have that. Can I have that? Are you trying to give that to me? Can I have that, baby? Yeah, can I have that? He loves this little toy right here that his, his Aunt Lisa got him. He loves that. But anyway, I'm really interested to see how he's going to do with cupcakes or if he's going to be like a wild child because, you know, I don't know how it is to give him any, like, you know, sugar and stuff like that. So I've heard stories though. Sometimes sugar can make ch children bounce off the walls. <laughs> so I'm interested to see how he's going to react to it. If it's going to be a good thing, a bad thing, is going to be mild. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see though when Josh gets home. So Josh uh, came home with a nice little, what's a strawberry cake? Oh, a slice of cake says, for uh, Mr. Hunter. What is this? Vanilla cake with strawberry whipped something. Jelly. He something. may or may not like that. I don't know. I think he will though. Look, boo. He just got finished eating and you know, he's in his high chair. So he does not like being confined. But honey, boo. Oh, look, look at his face. What's in there? I got some cake for you. You want some? Yeah. <laughs> he got food all over his face. Ooh, Mr. Hunter Man. You ready? Mmm, what's that? Is that delicious? Want some more? Mmm, happy birthday. Is it good? Is it delicious? Like, you already 
know it is. You have some? It's not bad. It's not bad. Want some more? Mmm. <laughs> what you think, Mr. Man? You have food all over your mouth and nose, boo. Yeah. Oh yeah. He's gonna be, look. He's probably be. He's probably gonna be um real hyper tonight. Well, uh, look, girl. <laughs> he said he picks up. Don't give him the whole cake. I'm not. But look, he's like, come on. Can you have a good birthday, boo? Can you have know, my mommy? Ah! Yeah? Can you know, mommy and daddy? It's gonna be a celebration on Saturday now. It's gonna be a celebration. What is going on, you guys? It is Saturday, and that means it is Hunter's birthday party day. And oh my gosh, y'all, I have been running around like a chicken with his head cut off, okay? Like yesterday, I spent all day actually cooking his cake, all of his cupcakes. I had to do like 50 cupcakes. Um, I made some cake pops. Um, we blew up the balloons for his balloon tower. We went over mom's house later on in the night and helped set up. Then this morning, I forgot that I, <laughs> I signed up for overtime at work, which was a bad idea, really, because I ended up wake I ended up waking up at like 3:45 to work from four to seven, and then after that, I waited for Hunter to wake up, give him a bath, and then we went back over to my mom's house so that we could finish setting up everything. But you guys, I am so happy with how everything has turned out. Like it's kind of, it's kind of been a stressful situation, but stressful in a good way because I'm just really proud of how everything looks and it's all coming together. Josh had to work this morning himself. He went in for a couple hours and then as soon as he got off, he went straight to my mom's house and he's, he's starting to cook the chicken wings and make the sandwiches and stuff like that. So. It has been a real team effort. Like Danny helped me with the balloons this morning. Mom has been uh, cooking as well. I think she made some lasagna and some other stuff. It's really been like a, a team family effort. <laughs> and I hope that Mr. Huntsman appreciates this stuff when he gets older and he sees the pictures and things like that because, oh my gosh, I never really knew just how much went into this type of birthday process. because. I mean, how, how would I know? I'm, I've never been a mom before, it's my first birthday. But I have to commend all the moms out there who have been doing this year over year because oh my goodness. I don't know if next year I'm gonna be making my own cakes and cupcakes and stuff like that. Woo, let me tell you. I understand why everything costs the way it costs. It takes some time. It really do. It really do. But anyway, I'm in the car. I'm on my way to pick up my best friend, Dominique. And then we're going to go to mom's house to finish uh, setting up. And yeah, it'll the party will start in about 40 minutes. It starts at 12. So from 12 to 3, I'm trying to get everybody in and out because, you know, it's New Year's Eve. So I'm trying to be respectful of their time because I just completely forgot that today was New Year's Eve. <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay, Mr. Hunter Man is in the back. He's starting to get antsy. So I'll check in later. All right. So we're going to start in the beginning. I don't know if it's the beginning, but we're going to start. So this little hanging feature is every month of Hunter's life that we did pictures for, you know, every month, you know. Miss Venus in the background. <laughs> That's not true. We got the chocolate fountain. It's not chocolate fountain right now. I don't know what's going on. Maybe I need to add more chocolate. Fruits over there. Mom got the old school candy. She says she won't make it no bags, but they can pick their own candy boxes. Boom. <laughs> 
Mom said she won't make it no candy candy bag. Get your own box and keep it keep it moving. <laughs> Arch over here with the one. And then of course you gotta come over to the the table's not completely done because you know we have the birthday stuff right there, but we're gonna fix that later. Got cupcakes. That's Chris, her king, and then well, the that, king. That's for his birthday. I mean, birthday. Oh, not Chris. Let me get it right. There you go. Mm -hmm. Crouches, and then we've got honey in the background, making food. Uh -huh. And then everybody gets to take a different picture home with them of Mr. Hunter over here. Wasn't that a good idea? I know, I got it from Pinterest. <laughs> All right. So I'm not doing a really good job of vlogging. <laughs> Because, you know, Venus don't want to be on camera. <laughs> but we did eat so far. Well, most every, everybody ate. Got the chicken wings over here, courtesy of the husband over here. Danny, Danny cooking them. Oh, Danny, Danny cooking them? Danny cooking them in the oil. I'm just there watching them. Oh, you, oh, you're supervising? I'm supervising. Okay. I mean, I put, I put the rub on them and, and then I put the sauce on them. But he's cooking them? Yeah, he's cooking them. Okay. So basically, Danny's cooking the chicken wings over here. Buffalo and barbecue. Boom. Cheese. It's plain cheese? Who idea was that? That's your mom. Oh, sorry, mom. Plain cheese over here. Rolls. Vegetables. Josh made, you made these though, right? Yeah, okay. Made some subs right here. Made some subs. Got a ham sub, got a roast beef sub, got a cracked pepper turkey sub. Okay. Got the lumpia. Lumpia. Got the meatballs. Meatballs. Going. Got the tempura shrimp over there. The shrimp. They got the lasagna. Lasagna. Mom showed out this lasagna. It's a huge lasagna. And then, of course, the fountain is over there. It's finally working. Boom. And with the fruit. I think the, the fountain is the main is the main course. Low. My balloons keep falling down. What Danny at? The balloons keep coming down on the end. Let me go get daddy again. Oh, he oh, don't fail there. Boom. Go on, go on we gotta do better than this. We gotta do better. We gonna sing, right? Oh, I see daddy. Ready? Okay. Ashley, sing. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. with him. They see he went about, Wee, yay! Okay. All right. There you go. Have some cake. Have some cake. Right there. Just shove it in your mouth. I just want to see the expression with the sweet. Put some in your mouth. Yeah, no, no, no. Alright. What is that? Is that delicious? Oh, honey. Is that delicious? Oh, you Hunter's first birthday party. 
down in the books. I think it was successful. What do you think, babe? Hella successful. Hella successful. He got a ton of gifts. Ton of gifts. A food, lot of food was great. Food was banging. Okay. A lot of people showed up. Yep. Good family. Family oh, encounters. You got food all over your mouth. I didn't wipe it. I didn't wipe it. I got it on my finger now. He got his Lamborghini. Mm -hmm. He gonna be out here stunting in the neighborhood with all the other kids mm -hmm. driving around his Lamborghini. Drifting, doing a drift. I don't, you know what? <laughs> the thing that they come up with was for kids is crazy. Anywho, it is 5.30 <laughs> and I'm ready to go to sleep. I was trying to stay up as, as long as I can, but I don't think I'm gonna make it to midnight. To, we're not making it a midnight. To I wish I, I'm not making it everybody a happy new year, but you know. Thinking, just in case I'm, I don't. I'm thinking nine o'clock at the latest. Nine o'clock at the latest? I don't know. Maybe <laughs> if you put something on TV, the Tulsa go, King, watch, catch up on our. Watch Tulsa King and chill and have a couple of little, sip on a little drink and drink while Hunter's asleep. Yeah. And, and kind yeah. of probably pass out. And the daddy's going to sleep. Daddy's going to sleep. sleep. Probably so. We're tired. We are tired. So anyway. Yeah, well, we don't have to work tomorrow. Who are you telling? Oh wait a minute. Rest. I do have to work tomorrow. <laughs> I have to work four hours. But it's alright. You can work four hours later. I'm going to do it from the bed. I'm going to do it from the bed. But anyway. If we don't see you at midnight. Happy New happy Year. Happy New Year's. <laughs> We're not going to see you at midnight. She's going to say Happy New Year's. <laughs> Okay, well, well then. That's actually lies. It just picks up the camera tomorrow. It says, oh, happy new year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to do that. But anyway, yeah, happy new year. And yeah, I guess we'll, we'll end it here. Catch you on the flip side. Catch you in 2020.